We're now ready to go through the process to save our final video in a format that we can upload to Moodle or upload to YouTube, whatever we wanted to do with that. Again, we want to save our project by just clicking on save. And the project is basically lining up all of our videos and all of our titles and clip art and audio and putting it into a timeline or into a scene line. Sharing the project is how we're going to turn that video from a project into something that we can view on other computers or, or on another website. When I click on share, I'll select computer. And from the computer process, I'm gonna to need to select a certain type of video file. I don't want it to be Adobe Flash or MPEG or AVI. I want it to be a Windows Media file, which is gonna turn it into a WMV. By clicking on Windows Media, I'm gonna get some different presets available. Keep the same, the preset that comes up, cable modem DSL. It's a very basic setting and it doesn't use much file space. If you had more file space or if you wanted a lot better quality, you could move down this list down to something like HD 720p with 30 frames per second. If you selected that, however, it would make a very large file size. We need to give our file a name. And I'm actually putting the words in here, final video. Remember our original title of our project might be something like my name is, but I'm changing the file name to my name is final video or maybe I just want to put my name is final. That word final means I know I'm going to be saving it as something that I can use in another program. I always want to browse and make sure I'm saving this in the right spot. Here in the middle school, I've always said to start with the word computer and from computer, click your H drive, go down to your tech folder that you've created and inside your tech folder, you'd select the folder where you'd want to save it. Say you were doing a dragster video, you could put it in dragsters or towers, put it in towers. But since this is just a regular video that we've learned how to use Adobe Premiere, I'm going to select editing and say, okay, I'm going to verify my settings. Windows media. I'm going to use the basic cable modem DSL setting for now. I've given it a file name that has the word final in it to draw my attention to it. And I'm going to save it in my tech editing folder. When I now say save, it's gonna go through the process to render the media. This is a very short video and it's only gonna take about 10 seconds to create. When it says done, I can click on the word done and I've saved that video. I want to double check to make sure that video is what I was hoping it was. So when I click on computer, I'm gonna to go to my H drive, tech editing, and I'm gonna see something in here with the word final. I'm also looking at some other things here. If I drag this over, I can see that I've got my name is final and it's saying something about Windows Media Audio Video File. That's going to be a WMV. I've got another WMV down here, but this purple file is a project file. And you can see project files are a lot smaller than the final video. My project file is only about 339, whereas my final video is about 681 kilobytes. If I double click that, it's going to open it up in a player. So people and you can see that it's playing my video. We would need to take that final video and upload it to Moodle like we've done before with our JPEGs and other files that we've worked on. Hopefully that helped you today. Good luck.